Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Today we talk about a movie called Interview with the Antichrist. Yes, there is a movie called Interview with the Antichrist. I came across this movie from one of my family members from Facebook contacted me and sent me a link for this trailer. Um, I thought it was a joke because I don't think anybody would do a movie like that. Like, I'm sure there's movies about the Antichrist and so on, like Omen for example. One, two, and three, and four, you know, for example, the Antichrist. But the, the way this movie was, it was like, when I saw the trails for it, I thought it was like, nah, this is like a waste of my time. I didn't care, you know? But then, when I keep looking at the trailer a second time around, I'm like, you know what? I might give this movie a chance. So I went online and found out about this director when I click on the trailer link. And the director that got the, 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 um, that did this movie had it online for four ninety nine to rent, and I think nine ninety nine to own it. You know, and um, I I paid for the four ninety nine for it, and you know what, guys and guys, I personally enjoyed the movie. I thought it was actually freaking good. You know, it's a simple movie. I think this is a religious, faith based movie. One of those religious faith movies. Because um, the way it ended and so on. And the way it came about, you know. And the movie is about, you know, the future. Like, what's going on in 2021. Which is this year. <laughs> yeah, right. About this guy who, who interviewed the Antichrist in a warehouse. And um, he's trying to give the Antichrist the questions about why is this world like this? What, like, how come you ain't changing nothing? You know, people are dying, being hungry, or what, pretty much whatever, with this locust, these demons in the world, and the Antichrist is just like, he's, he's not like your Damon Omen type of Antichrist, but he has somewhat of a little conscious, this Antichrist just don't give a shit at all, he was like, I don't care, <laughs> you know, people are dying, and he's, t and then he talks about how, how like Netflix, how people worship certain things, um, he talked about the coronavirus, how it's the start of everything. He talked about the bad history that happened before the coronavirus, like 9-11, the Clark Calabine shooting. And um, I'm not going to ruin stuff in this movie in every single scene. But the movie is mostly this guy interviewing the Antichrist. But it's really good, though, because it's like it keeps you glued. And how people talk about the world today, about the government and the conspiracies and all that. This Antichrist... Tells, talks to you about all that stuff, you know, and he gives answers to everything. Now, I know it's a movie only, but, yo, it gets you kind of believing, you know, it keeps you thinking. And, um, like, especially with people talking about today right now, with the conspiracies and their opinion of how the world is and who's trying to set things up. And this Antichrist, the second he says, talks about every single stuff in the detail. And while he's, while the interview was interviewing the Antichrist, the interviewer also have a twist in himself also, which I will not spoil for you guys. And the ending in this movie was really good though. It played a really good part how this movie is. And it was a good it was a good little twist, I would say, in my opinion. Um, but it has a meaning to it. It may not the ending might not be for everybody, you know. But if you watch this movie you can understand. Um the acting was pretty good. You know, the writing, the script, you know, how they set that up. Um, kudos to directors and people behind this movie. I thought it was a great movie, and it's simple, too. Um, the music was cool with the credits and the ending. Um, the problem with the interview, that when he interviewed the Antichrist, also I want to mention that there's, pe there's scenes with people all over the world watching this interview. So this interview is like live broadcast while this is going on, and all over the world is watching this. So I thought that concept was pretty cool and see people's reaction of how the Antichrist is saying and giving his answer. Um, this movie is definitely check it out. It's on Vimo, which this director released. So watch it now. Um, I heard it was released last last month. No, not last month. I mean in December of 2020. And they say it's going to be on online for a little while. Because I think the director's going to get this out in the theaters or video demand out in public much for a bigger audience. So definitely check it out. I'll post the link too so you guys want to check it out. Anyway, see you later and have a good night.